was doing a little purge of my file cabinet tonight and I ran into the scrap folder and I just had to shoot a clip of this stuff before I trash it because starting about 10 years back I used to do a ton of scrapping and I mean look at look at how many receipts I have from mostly cast iron brake rotors and catalytic converters aluminum wheels all that kind of stuff but a lot of junk cars too i used to hang these signs around locally and i was i was getting 500 or 550 a car at one one point and buying cars for 400 fixing ones that i could and junking the rest i i had a good little thing going on and i would go to all the different shops around i printed this out on google maps and i i uh, had contacts all over i'd sometimes pay people a dollar a rotor and whatnot and it was uh it was pretty decent a ton of catalytic converters, and I just figured, I mean, look at all these notes I used to keep. <laughs> this stuff's hilarious. But the best part of it is I almost wanted to add all these up and see what it equals, but look at look at these. In fact, the first one, I'll cover my name up on there. In 2009, I started this, so in December 2009, I was only getting $5.50, 100 pounds for, uh, for cast iron. That's not much. And then, I mean, at one point, scrap was really good. So let's check it out. I was getting like, uh, I got at $14.50 for cast iron right there. $14.50, 100 pounds. That was when it was really good. I just wanted to shoot a clip, though, before I trash all this stuff. Because, I mean, look at all that. Piles of piles and piles. This is why your body hurts, Chris. This is why your wrists hurt. I had to add up how many pounds of scrap I've Good stuff. <laughs>